take the building off of him. Try to go about approaching and kind of reach to reach the enemy here. I wanted to honor the uh, one and two over in the baby two season. Jeff Logan and I and Marvel put our heads together at the beginning of this season. I have a number of really awesome ideas for things that we love. Only a couple of years. So. Um, yeah, you know, look, I, I'm a big fan of both costumes. Um, the the black costume from season one is vaguely more comfortable, um, and it's, it makes it a lot easier for me to pee um, during, the, during the course of an evening. Um, but I also, you know, look, I'm, over the course of these last four years, I've become a huge fan of this of this character, obviously. Um, and, and, and so wearing the, the black costume has been really fun and it's been like an homage to season one. It's also bittersweet because I, 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 I love the iconic red suit. Um, I did take a lot of pleasure from seeing someone else have to wear the red suit and deal with the same issues that I had from, from season two. Was it, tough, was it as tough as it was for Charlie? I don't know what you're talking about. I didn't know it's him. That's Vincent in that costume, bro. <laughs> yeah, I love it. I would love to see the Kingpin play Daredevil for a while because that character is so intense. How do you get to that place that terrifies me just to... It, it comes natural. <laughs> no more questions, then. No, Karen, I feel like I should be asking questions Karen should, because it wasn't so good to me. TV. Where do you get that, that guts that you did you talk to real supporters? She goes at it more than anyone I've ever seen. Oh wow, thanks so much. Actually my aunt teaches journalism, so I had a really good um, resource in that. Um, but also, you know, I really admire Karen's sort of bravery in that. Like she doesn't care if you don't like her or anything like that. She's gonna like push you and get the get the answer out of you. So I'm I'm not that brave. <laughs> so I enjoy kind of learning from her by playing that. It's really heartbreaking to spend so to see. You know, there's a bit of a, a distance between Matt and Foggy and Karen. What was it like being on set and, you know, not always being funny funny to stuff like You don't get to play with your favorite people. There was a moment where we were looking at each other, like, waiting for three takes. We were like, this is weird. We're working together again. Yeah, this is kind of awesome. Like, oh, it felt strange. But at the same time, it's, you know, it's nice to see these characters explore, you know, other areas and get deeper into their backstory. You know, I don't want to get too spoilery here, but you thought he really stepped up in the season. He's got, he's got some big, gutsy moments. This is... This is true. Uh, Eric did an incredible job. Uh, I couldn't be happier over the season. There's a lot of exciting stuff for Foggy. He gave more of his backstory. He sort of finds his footing, you know, away from Matt. 